was five ticket sales commenced both online and here at the box office at 233 234 Camp Street in Georgetown. There were scores of persons. This is just a fraction of the amount of persons that are currently here at the box office. While many persons were camera shy, uh, they were explained to me that they were early as four hours this morning. Some stated they traveled from since uh, three o'clock this morning because they were out of town to ensure they get in line early to get those tickets. These tickets that were released today are for the CPL finals. Ghana is going to be hosting that entire finals week for the next three years and the period for those final matches are between September 27th to the 30th. The grand final is on the 30th at the National Stadium Providence. The cost of tickets for the first three knockout matches will be the same as the Guyana Amazon Warriors group matches. For the home matches, tickets cost $2,500 for the Grass Monk, $3,300 for the Orange Stand, and $5,500 for the Red Stand, and $6,000 for the Green Stand. The final is marginally more expensive as the prices are $3,000 for the Grass Monk, $4,000 for the Orange Stand, $6,000 for the Red Stand, and $6,500 for the Green Stand. Ticket sales for the group matches in Guyana commence on July 19th and some matches are approaching a sold out status, especially those that feature the home franchise. On September 21st, Barbados Royals will face St. Kitts and Nevis Patriots from 10 hours, followed by the Amazon Warriors and the Jamaica Tallowers from 19 hours. Trinbago Knight Riders and St. Kitts and Nevis Patriots will clash from 10 hours on September 22nd, then the Warriors will play St. Lucia Kings from 19 hours. The lone match on September 24 is the Knight Riders against the Amazon Warriors from 19 hours. On September 25th, the Tallowers and Kings will play the morning fixture and the Warriors will face Barbados Royals from 19 hours to conclude the tournament's group matches. For the newsroom, Akim Green.